Welcome to <laughs> what to it do with your boy Battle Truth. Welcome to another day of the preliminaries, man. Where we go through the Smack Volume Four card that's taking place, man. Geechee Gotti versus Arsenal, the Rebel, will be taking place. Smack Volume Four, February the ninth, going down. Um, let's get right off into it. The preliminaries, where we take both MCs who book to battle, bring them together. We go through their strengths and weaknesses. We give a breakdown uh, uh, of each MC, and we see if this battle makes sense. Do it make sense? Like in a preliminary hearing, if you ever been booked or something like that and fighting the case, you go through what it called a preliminary hearing where they bring out all the evidence against you. The uh, judge uh, uh, listen to both parties. Then the, he decide whether or not it's probable cause and enough evidence for the case to go forward to trial. And this is what we're going to do. Do this battle make sense? Arsenal the Rebel versus Geechee Gotti. Let's get right off into this. Let's talk about their last wins and loss. Last win Geechee Gotti had came to the hands of him beating, I believe, I'm going to say JC, he beat JC, because I definitely have him losing a T-Top, Rum Nitty, K-Shine. So I believe his last win came to him at the hands of uh, JC. I think he beat JC or Shotgun Should, whichever one it was. Last JC or Shotgun Should. His last loss came to the hands of uh, K-Shine. K-Shine beat him 3-zip at Smack Volume 3. Arsenal last win came uh, from him defeating New Jersey Twerk. His last loss came to him by the hands of, I want to, uh, Hollow the Dine. Hollow the Dine. Um, at Smack Volume 2. Now, What are their strengths and weaknesses? Geechee Gotti is known for that street feel, that real talk. Um, that's what he's known for. That real street talk, street feel. That's his strength. He got a good way of putting words together when painting that picture to make you feel the reality of that street life. What about Arsenal the Rebel? What is his street? Uh, uh, his strength. His strength is that he's very energetic, aggressive, animated on stage. He definitely know how to battle rap. Uh, performance. Very witty and creative with wordplay. His flow is crazy off the chain. Very versatile. Man, and he, again, one of his strong points, he know how to battle rap. He know how to battle rap. Um, Arsenal, the rebel. Um, Arsenal, the rebel. No, his last win. I believe his last win. I think he beat past day. I think Arsenal beat past day. That was his last win, I meant. So, yeah, his strength, that's his strength, man. Arsenal is among them. Definitely know how to battle rap. That crazy. And what I mean by battle rap, meaning he knows how to battle rap. Everything that has to do with a battle rapper, he knows how to battle rap. He's very intelligent when it comes to this game. What is they weaknesses? Geechee Gotti weaknesses is he lack performance, stage presence. Um, Lyrical-wise, he not as strong. Lyrical wise, um, but other than that, you know what I'm saying? He, 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 uh, what's some more weakness of Geechee? That's basically it. That's basically it. Um, cause he barely stumbled sometimes, but he don't jersey out and choke on his rounds, but he stumbles sometimes. What about Arsenal? What is his weakness? Arsenal sometimes tend to take off rounds. Don't really care sometimes about certain battles. He has been known to forget some of his rounds going his phone. Um, 
that's basically it when it comes to him. His weaknesses, you know. Um, who does this battle mean more to? Who does this battle mean more to? I think this battle means more to both of them. I think this battle means a lot to Geechee Gotti because it shows how good he can handle himself when dealing with the elites. It shows, uh, it, it, it means a lot because he get to show his versatility and how he can adjust to different styles he's not familiar with. Arsenal is a legend. Arsenal is a guaranteed Mount Rushmore first ballot. Arsenal also, if that person on your resume, you cannot avoid not capitalizing off of to have him on your resume. You want to at least beat him or make it classic. So, in Geechee Gotti is being right now pushed by the URL. They got they they praising him. Him and New Jersey twerk is leading the rush right now. And the crazy thing about it is this battle would say a lot if he could handle Arsenal. Because Arsenal on every level is going to come with it. I know Arsenal could do what Geechee Gotti do. But I don't know if Geechee Gotti can do what Arsenal do. So this battle mean a lot. For, this battle should mean a lot for Geechee Gotti when you're going up against a legend, a Hall of Famer like Arsenal, and you want to show that you can't compete against the elites. Now, you took a beating. You took a beating to K-Shine, who was another elite, who was another elite. You took another beating to Danny Myers, who is another elite. So you have to take advantage of these elites when it comes to you getting these brothers. You took a beating to Rum Nitty. You took a beating to Av when dealing with these elites. Now, you can hang in there, but you're going to really, really, really have to step it up pin game-wise when going up against these elites. And this is a good battle to test your pin and capitalize off of. Now, when it comes to Arsenal, this battle should mean a lot to Arsenal, too, because Arsenal is known for, to rise into the occasion on the battles that he wants. We saw what he did to Lux. We saw what he did to Iron Solomon. We saw what he did to New Jersey Twerk. We saw what he did to Past Day. We saw what he did to, um, we saw what he did when he was going up against, uh, uh, um, oh, my shoddy horror and them, you know, so. When it's battles he won't, he rides to the occasion. And if he could bring that type of energy to New Jersey twerk, he definitely going to bring it to Geechee because he know Geechee is also a rising star like New Jersey twerk. He also know that Geechee popularity is growing big. He know that the URL is pushing Geechee. And the same example he wanted to make out of twerk, this should be no different. He should do the same thing to Geechee Gotti. He finna do the new, uh, uh, that he did to New Jersey twerk. And this is why I have to pick Arsenal in this battle. Arsenal, no battle rap. He no battle rap. I don't see Geechee Gotti beating him on no level. Talking to him, no street talk. Uh, he's not going to outperform uh, Arsenal. He's not going to outbar Arsenal. He's not going to outrap Arsenal. He's not going to be as energetic as Arsenal. His stage presence ain't going to be better than Arsenal. He ain't going to be uh, uh, more aggressive than Arsenal. I see Arsenal beating him on every level. Every level. And this should be crazy, man. I'm just keeping it real with you, man. I want to say Arsenal 3-zip, but Arsenal tend to get off topic sometimes and do filler. But for the most part, Arsenal going to come with three rounds of high-energy, aggressive, disrespectful bars. I just don't want Arsenal. Just don't be too... Per, too aggressive to the point where it becomes tacky, like you did with you and Hollow, like you did with you and K Shine, like you did with you and um, you and uh, you and K Shine, you and Hollow, 
Um, we did it to a couple more, brother, too. I'm just trying to remember. Yeah, don't be too, don't be so tacky though to that degree. Now, um, knowing your opponent, who who should this be? Who should this mean more to? I think it's Arsenal. It should mean more to you. You know the importance of how this battle would be, knowing that you took out both of the URLs, Rising Stars, back to back. You blast Geechee Gotti in New Jersey twerk. You blast them both back to back. They look good. They look good for you, man. They look good for you. You should be aware of that. So this should mean more to you because it's a lot at stake. It seemed like Arsenal, since his return back to the URL, just been on fire. I'm just keeping it 100 with you. Been on fire. You know, got to write some things down. Um, and see, sometimes blogs come to me just while I'm writing. Yeah, that mean a lot, man. Uh, them brothers just been on fire, man. And um, I'm just sitting here listening to the battle with him in New Jersey twerk, and he went off. This should be no different. I think Geechee Gotti get the same treatment New Jersey twerk got. Yeah, that's who it was, New Jersey twerk. You was a little too extra in the New Jersey twerk battle, uh, Arsenal. You was a little too extra in the Iron Solomon battle. You was a little too extra in the Hollow the Dime battle. You was a little too extra in the um, um, K-Shine battle. Just, 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 man, look. Yo, 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 yo stuff say enough. You don't have to do that, man. Just be flawless, the arsenal that you is, man. Just be that. Um, when we talking about um who this battle mean more to, it definitely arsenal. Who has the advantage in a small room? I think that's arsenal too. I think Nothing Geechee Gotti going to do is going to outdo Arsenal. I'm sorry. It's not going to happen. Unlike the K-Shine situation that happened where people were trying to call all type of texts on Arsenal. I mean, on K-Shine that they wanted to give you the victory. Talking about it was gassing in there and how he had uh, sounded like New Jersey twerk. And they wanted to just disqualify the man and automatically give you the uh, battle on that. This ain't going to be that way on Arsenal. Arsenal got his own style. Arsenal going to be dancing all around you, man. Literally. That's going to be crazy. That's going to be crazy. Can't wait to see it, man. Um, with that being said, I think Arsenal has the advantage in this small room. Um, do this battle make sense to me? So, 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 so. I see the benefits in it from both MCs. If Geechee win, I see how they can benefit him, definitely. If Arsenal win, I see how that benefit him. So, yeah, I, I'm going to say it makes sense. It definitely makes sense. It makes sense to the point that I want to see this battle. I can't wait to see it. Um, I can't wait to see it, and I'm taking Arsenal in this battle. I want to say 3-zip, but I'm going to give it to Arsenal 2-1 over Geechee Gotti. Arsenal 2-1 over Geechee Gotti. I definitely feel that it's probable cause in this. It's more than enough evidence for this battle to go forward. And I can't wait to see it. Smack Volume 4 taking place February the 9th. Order the pay-per-view. It's going down. This your boy Battle Truth. It ain't my judgment. That's some question. It's yours. Welcome to another. Uh, thank you for joining me for another day of the preliminaries. I'm definitely signing off on this. I really believe that it's a lot in that, and that's going to be a classic battle probably. Um, very full of energy, going to be a classic battle. So with that being said, thank you for watching another day of the preliminary. This your boy, Battle Truth, and ain't my judgment, that's some question. It's yours, man. It's going down, man. Um, I holler at you, man.
Salute.